Hey guys, I never thought I'd be making this video, but I no longer work for YouTube. I've actually got a new job, and that is a forklift driver. That's right, this pays much more than YouTube's paying me right now, so uh, I'm gonna stick with this for a while. Anyway, it's 8 a.m., and I've got an early shift, so I gotta make it to work. Only problem is, these roads are a bit wild at times, so better get an early start, or else my boss will be mad. Alright, here we go. It's actually my first day on the job. I've actually never worked here before. So this is my first time taking this road. It's not too bad right now. But someone I'm working with tells me it's very, very crazy. And he does not recommend taking this road. But if I don't take this road, I'll be late for work. We can't be having that. Anyway, what does it say? Ah, oh, why yes. Don't touch the red brakes. Why would I? That's the curb. That's where the pedestrians walk. Here I go. Oh, wow. It looks like a co-worker's in front of me. A couple co-workers, actually. Uh, <laughs> guys, it said don't touch the red brick. Look at these guys. Look how well they're lined up. <laughs> oh, poor co-workers. Oh, there goes another. Oh. <laughs> I can kind of see why people are warning me about this taking this road. But I'm confident about my driving skills. Look at me go. Oh, oh, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Oh, oh no. So guys, I just got back from the mechanic. I got into a little car accident. Other than that, I'm fine. My boss understood. He said I can keep the job. As long as I get into work today, we're fine. It's been three days since I recorded that last part of my first day of work. And it'll be a couple more days until I actually get to work. Hey guys. Yeah, I'm back again from the mechanic. Got a new forklift. I did suffer a couple injuries from that, uh, that car crash I just had. It was worse than the first one. But don't worry, guys. I I'm feeling better. I just can't feel my legs right now. But who needs legs when you're driving a forklift? Oh, no. I'm going to touch that red brick, aren't I? Oh, oh. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, I'll be... I was going to say I would be back. And so I am. It's been a couple days again. Uh, my boss is kind of getting angry at me. For, uh, not really showing him to work. Hold on. Is it this that's touching the front? Oh, it is, it is, it is. <laughs> my, my boss is going to have to wait a couple more minutes. I mean, days. I'm going to be one of his best workers, I promise. What I figured out is on a forklift, you can actually raise the uh, the tongs, as I'm going to call them. Anyway, let's do this. Um, So now that my tongs won't touch the red brick, and now I just got kind of a square car, which would be much easier to turn around these corners, which it is. And we are just about to make it to the next uh road. This road is a bit twisty and turny, as you can see. Oh, there goes another co-worker. And I swear I just saw Billy on my screen. But anyway, Billy wasn't really needed since I'm going to be the best worker my boss has ever had. Look at me take these turns so nicely. Uh-oh. 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 Okay. So now I can see why they call this road a bit dangerous. But don't worry. All I have to do is raise my tongs. All the way up. Why not? Let's get a bit top-heavy here. This guy's got an orange one. I would really love an orange one. Can I buy that? <gasps> I can use it. I can use it. Yes, it matches my hoodie, kind of. It's not the perfect color, but it's better. And now I got a better forklift than everyone else in here. Other than that guy. That guy's looking great. As he's got the same forklift as me. The Mercury forklift. Oh. Every time someone crashes, my eyes freeze up. Anyway, let's not mind that. We'll crash on this road all the time, but I'm not going to be one of those people, because... Anymore, anyway. I know I've crashed a couple of times, but no longer am I going to crash, because I have figured out a new technique. Okay, well, that technique did not last very long. I'm now on the couple final turns, but one of my co-workers are uh, stuck on their side. I'm sorry, buddy, but I cannot lift you up with my forklifts, because you are actually a ghost. You've died too many times to come back to life. So I'm just gonna have to leave you there. Oh, 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 oh no, that's close. That. Oh, we're, we're good, we're good. And just like that, we've made it. One of the first buildings I have to walk through. This building doesn't really have any um roof. And it's missing a section out of the wall, but that's perfect for the forklift. I just gotta raise my tongs the perfect amount, be the same level of this gap. So now my tongs can go right through it. As you can see right here, wabam. Anyway, this is one of the harder parts of this road, I've been told, by my co-worker, and I can see why. I am I'm in the ground. I am missing my wheels. My wheels are in the ground. I, I might as well just walk from here, but I cannot do that. So I must end it all. Now that I've been brought back to life by the nice doctor, I can try this again. 
I have not been giving you guys updates on my boss recently because he's been ignoring my messages. But I'm sure he'll get over the fact that I've been late every single day so far. Once I get there, of course. Until then, we're stuck on this road. I also just noticed my graphics were really low, so I put my glasses on. And now look at the place. It's looking much better. This is the new strategy to get better at the game. I mean, not, not the game, at work, at forklift driving. And just like that, after raising my graphics quality, I made it a second try. This next part looks a bit difficult because the hole in the wall actually changes. As you can see, it raises a little bit here, which means I would have to raise my tongs if I wanted to put them through there. But right now, don't need to worry about that because I just need to fit through this tiny little hole, which I'm going to do perfectly because I'm a professional forklift driver. I'm certified, actually. Tongs will fit through here. Oh, oh. Okay, now this is the part where I might need to raise my tongs. I'll do so right now, actually, in case. I'm actually, I'm very much struggling here. Turn around. Oh, tongs, please don't mess me up. That should be a good height, I think. We are good. We are good. We are not touching the walls. My boss is going to be so happy. This is also good practice for my first day at the job because you cannot be crashing into things with your forklift, okay? And so I'm getting used to driving through tight spaces without touching any of the walls or obstacles. So I'm ready for my first day. And just like that, boom. Now we are onto the bridge. The bridge was constructed by gremlins. Gremlins that wanted to kill humans. And so they built this bridge, hoping that humans would drive across it and uh, fall off. And well, they did a good job, as you can see right there. But not with me, a certified forklift driver. I know how to turn this thing like a professional, like a professional. Oh, professionals do mess up sometimes, but never a second time. Okay, well, it is my first day and I do not have beginner's luck right now, but don't worry as I am a certified forklift driver. Oh God, oh no, oh no. I just got a message from my boss. He hasn't texted in a while, so I was surprised. This message said, if you're late one more time, you'll be ran over by a forklift. Well, the thing is, boss, if I'm late one more time, I'm already dead. Other than that, I will get to work on time without fail. I'm just going to take it slow and steady. I really don't want to lose this forklifting job because YouTube's not, uh, YouTube's not really paying me and I, I can't, cannot live off YouTube. Okay, I actually think I might have take, might have done the first turn. My back wheel is off. My front wheel is off. Please, please, please. I think we might make it. We did, we did, we did, we did. Okay, boss. There's three more turns. No worries, though. I'm a professional forklift driver, and my mom says I'm great at it. <laughs> Unlike that person that just fell. Don't worry, he wasn't really needed, since he's not as great as me. As you can see, I'm doing this perfectly. Okay, well, see some going back to YouTube. Please like, subscribe, and comment down below. And please tell me what level you got to. Because I only got to level 9. And my boss is not very happy about that.